One response that has been seen all over social media and shared by Barack Obama, our former president, among others, an impromptu plea for change from one mother who says she survived the Highland Park parade shooting last summer. Aren't you guys tired of being here and having to cover all of these mass shootings? How is this still happening? How are our children still dying and why are we failing them? These shootings and these mass shootings will continue to happen until our lawmakers step up and pass gun safety legislation. Ashby Beasley says she was at the site of a deadly shooting near Chicago at a 4th of July parade with her young son when seven people were killed and dozens were injured. Beasley says she was in town to visit her sister-in-law, but also planned to meet with Shondell Brooks, whose son, Aquila De Silva, was murdered in the 2018 Antioch Waffle House shooting right here in the Nashville area. The two have connected over their shared experiences. We were about to have lunch when she called me and she was very upset telling me that her son, her living son, was on lockdown at his school because there was a mass shooting at another school right down the street. And my heart broke. This is where we're at. We have children living through multiple mass shooting incidences. What are we doing? Beasley says she has lobbied for gun safety in Washington and stopped by Nashville on her way back from meeting with lawmakers for a 12th time. Now she has met with more than 130 members of Congress so far. She says strengthening gun laws, including a federal assault weapons ban, will save lives. A ban was signed into law in Illinois in January.